Sometimes a little Christmas cheer is all you need during the holiday season, especially for those who may not be able to get home and see their families. And today we're going to see warmer temperatures, so hopefully that brings you at home some cheer because it's been rather chilly the past week. I know I am a little bit over the cooler temperatures and although it's not going to be warm by any means it's going to be warmer than where we've been and I'm definitely looking forward to that. We're also going to be a little bit breezy today uh, but that will help to warm those temperatures and temperatures this week are trending warmer and precipitation wise a little bit of a break today and tomorrow and we're looking at some isolated late week chances and some chances early next week. Today though, 24 degrees for a high temperature, partly cloudy and a bit breezy. Winds from south between 15 and 25 miles per hour, gusting to 35 miles per hour at times. And across the region, those high temperatures in the 20s, so much better than where they were at yesterday, where they were in the single digits and low teens across the region. We are going to be a bit breezy today with sustained winds between about 15 and 25 miles per hour with those gusts up to around 30 to 35 miles per hour across the region. Wind chills this morning as you're heading out the door, still a little bit on the chillier side, but as we head through today, by about the noon hour, starting to see those above zero. And so definitely going to feel much warmer, especially in the afternoon and evening hours. Heading through today, we are going to be quiet, so uh, not too much to talk about, at least weather uh, precipitation wise today. We are going to be quiet and we're going to be calm. I said a little bit of a break from that precipitation, but we are also going to be warmer and seeing those winds from that the south pushing in warmer air to the area, helping to warm those temperatures. Overnight, we're not going to drop our temperatures too much, and then that will also help us to get a little bit warmer for our Wednesday as those temperatures are already going to be in the 20s across the region. And then we're going to see those temperatures tomorrow into the 30s. Above average temperatures looking to continue over the next couple of days heading into the new year. So that is something to look forward to if those cooler temperatures that we've been seeing haven't been your forte. Today though, a little bit below average still for our high temperature, but then right back to above average tomorrow. And looking at our six to 10 day temperature outlook from the Climate Prediction Center for January 1st through 5th, seeing the models trending towards above average temperatures continuing through the beginning of 2023. Tonight, a low of 22 degrees, partly cloudy skies and a bit breezy with those winds still gusting up to about 30 miles per hour across the region and those lows in the low to mid 20s. So like I said, not too much of a difference between our high temperatures and our low temperatures today, but uh, tomorrow our highs are going to be into the 30s, 34 for us here in Rochester, still seeing those breezy conditions and across the region seeing those even warmer temperatures than today. Some areas even close to that 40 degree mark. 37 in Red Wing for a high for a Wednesday, 38 over in Winona. So definitely something to look forward to if those cooler temperatures haven't been uh, very uh, nice to you. I know the cool air has given me some issues, but uh, we're going to see warmer air and we do have some precipitation chances throughout the week, but like I said, we are quiet for at least today and tomorrow. And with those warmer temperatures, it's going to be much more pleasant. Absolutely, and, and quiet is always a good thing. Yes, for sure. Thank you, sorry.